What's going on YouTube? It's Davis, aka McFlozard, back with another video, and today I will be doing a Madden 20 head-to-head. -head. That's my top three. I recently just got Aaron Donald, by the way, and powered him up, and he's a 99 with chemistries, so I did that because of all the Eric Dickerson stretch, which is really annoying. Um, his top three are all gold 99s, he's doing an onside kick, of course. I hate onside kicks so much because there's like this cheese way to get it every single time and it's so annoying. Alright, it went out of bounds. I don't think it was far enough to actually be his ball, but don't want to take my chances. Alright, so we're going to be looking for George Kittle on this play. No one's open. All right, yeah, George Kittle actually was open on that play. I just thought he was going to keep running through with um, Luke Keithley, I'm pretty sure, on that play. Second and 10. Don't know what I was doing there. All right, third down. I have to get this. Jumped. Nice, that's a flag. All right. Terrible pass by Michael Vick. Yeah, for some reason, Michael Vick was so good for me when I first got him. And then now his throws are off. So I might have to look into getting a new quarterback. I don't know. Definitely going to guard Franco Harris on that clowny. He's on a spy, actually. Nice. What? All right, well... Sammy Watkins was supposedly out of bounds. That's what Madden says. Should have been inbounds. That's stupid. We're going to go for it anyways because run is 40 and we can't score a field goal. So might as well. Don't have much to lose. Let's go. It's Michael Thomas. All right. So we got the first. Uh, we're on his 33-yard line. And, yeah, so if we, we could have punted it there, I guess, but it wasn't really worth it. We had good field position, just not enough for a field goal. Dang it. Come on. RB. Dang it. All right. Alright, so dang it. All right. So I couldn't really get anything going that play or that drive, so I'm just gonna go for the field goal. Not trying to waste another fourth and five if I miss it, so I'm just gonna take my three. Now I'm kicking off to him. Don't know whose returner is yet. Corey Holt, of course. Pretty deep kick. And he's returning it. All right. Nice tackle. He's on his 21-yard line. Yeah, so um, my Tory Holt's a 98 overall. I'm really close to getting him to his 99. But from his stats, with chemistries added, he seems a lot better than Tyreek Hill as a returner if you have X-Factors on him. He has a lot better speed, and he's taller and a of course, Eric Dickerson's stretch. Yeah, that's why I got Aaron Donald, because I'm tired of Eric Dickerson and his stupid stretch plays. And another one, okay. Nice. All right, two runs for four yards. I would definitely take that, because he usually gets one run for touchdown. And yeah, so he has Cunningham at quarterback. And... Ever since Ultimate Legends came out, I feel like it's a lot harder to... Oh my gosh. That was definitely pass interference. But back to what I was saying. Um, it's a lot harder to win games when since these Ultimate Legends came out. Because, you know, human joystick quarterback. Every single person has Randall Cunningham. Eric Dickerson, 97 overall. 
Of course. Just another cheese play to his tight end. It's fine. We'll stop him. All right. So his he still has his, his X Factor on Eric Dickerson. It lasts five plays. So that should be running. In, oh my gosh. Yeah, that's the Eric Dickerson I know. And all three of the runs have been stretches. He's just hurrying his offense up. Another stretch. Sit down, kid. That's Kevin Green. Yeah, so since I've gotten Kevin Green, he's been a huge help to my team. And Aaron Donald, I just got him too. So, yeah, I'm trying to make big changes to my defensive line. Nice. It's Kevin Green again. See, that's what I'm saying. He's a big game changer. Him and Aaron Donald have made this team so much better. I'm trying to... Yeah, I'm trying to make my defensive line better. All right, nothing much. He was at third and 24. Fourth and 14, and he's going for it. He doesn't really have much to lose, but it's kind of risky. I would probably go for it, too. Incomplete. Let's go. Don't. That was a really bad pass for Randall Cunningham. He's usually a lot better throwing those passes, too. All right, play action. Yeah, no one was open on that play. Couldn't, yeah, I'm one for six, seven yards. That's not good at all. Let's try and get the run game going a little. Don't think it really has so far, but we'll try. Yeah, there's, yeah, I need to upgrade my offensive line a lot. I, have st I still have a 92 center. I really need to change that to like a 96 or something. I feel like that's my weak spot. Nice. Nice play to Calvin Johnson. It was a little risky, but I'll take whatever I can get. Especially against a guy who's super good. Stretch. We'll try a stretch for you. Nice juke, Saquon. All right. Yeah, so I have... I or no, I used to have an X-Factor on Saquon Barkley where he never fumbled on hit stick plays, and I feel like he fumbles every single game off a of hit stick. So I just got rid of the X-Factor and chose a new one because it was pretty much a waste of an X-Factor. But it's second and three right now, and I'm, I put George Kittle on a um, little fade or cross, whatever it's called. RB. Let's go! Touchdown, Michael Thomas. Nice play. All right. That was actually really insane. Oh, my gosh. I did not believe he caught that. Dang. All right. This is what we need. Now we're up 10-0. He hasn't quit yet. That's really surprising. That was a really weak kick, but come on. Oh my gosh, he's just faster than Jesse Tuggle. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Tory Holt is really good. I'm pretty sure his Tory Holt's a 99. I didn't I don't know if he's in his top three or not. But yeah, that's super annoying. Let me guess another Eric Dick. Yep. Another Eric Dickerson stretch. Sit down. That's Jamal Adams. Yep, another stretch, and it's get. He can't do anything with his Eric Dickerson. He had one good play, and that's where he cut inside on the stretch. But after that, he's really no. He's not going anywhere. All right, third down. Can we stop him? Any stupid play. I thought he caught that for a second. That would have, that would have made me almost quit. <laughs> what was? Did you just see Casey Hayward on that replay? He was like stumbling over absolutely nothing. All right, come on. Nope, incomplete. All right, turnover on downs. Nice. Come on. 
Yeah, I don't I don't think he put a QB spy on, so I'm just gonna run. Caught him sleeping. George Kittle? Yep. It's open. Yeah, this time I chose that route because last time I realized he was open, so I'm gonna go back to it again. Alright, you know what? Since he does stretch, I'm gonna do a stretch. His Eric Dickerson is probably ten times better than Saquon Broccoli, but Oh my gosh. Tackled for a loss, of course. I didn't realize Nick Bosa was that good either. He has a 96, but he plays like he's a 99. He's one of those super glitchy cards, just like Eric Dickerson. All right, we got the first down with Mark Andrews. I'll just take the short pass. Not trying to risk it. It's third down. You know, you got to play smart, especially if we want him to quit. Don't know how he hasn't quit yet because we're having a really nice drive. Come on. Oh, my gosh. See? That's the one fumble that Saquon Barkley has every game. And, of course, it was to Pat Tillman. He always makes me fumble. All right, so now I'm guessing... Yep, another stretch play. Sit down, Eric Dickerson. You're literally getting destroyed on the stretch. I don't know how many times he's gotten a gain on a stretch. Probably like twice. Come on. Oh my gosh. You know what? That's so annoying. Just the stupid cheese route with, of course, Tory Holt. Nice player in the game. Nice. Kevin Green. Oh, wait, no. Pat Tillman. So confusing to see the people. I have Clay Matthews, Kevin Green, and Pat Tillman on my team. They're all white and they have that blonde long hair. So it's so confusing. Oh, Eric Dickerson. Nice. Oh my gosh. Michael Strahan just came in clutch. Yeah, I saw that route going to Eric Dickerson, so I can't believe he just did that. That's the best defensive block I've ever seen by um, a uh, lineman. Okay, of course. You know what? I, I just have to start manning on Torrey Holt. He's just going to do that every single play. Do the out or the in. And that's what you get. Sacked. Casey Hayward. He likes to hurry up his offense a lot. Of course, same play. I was almost there. I tried to hit stick him at the end, but he keeps doing that stupid possession catch. So it's hard to do it. How did he just catch that? I was there too. I'm so done with this game. It's oh my gosh. Come on. I was I was there too with Kevin Green. I just got behind him. I knew he was gonna throw that. Yeah, juice in the shoes. I haven't seen you this entire game. All right. Come on. He's at the seven. Better get some sort of pick or fumble. Let's go, Stefan Gilmore. Nice pick. All right. I'm not trying to score, but if I could score, that would be nice. That was so close. That was a nice pick. All right. Let's go, Saquon. Oh, if that guy was... If Byron Jones is... He's on my team, and... He is so good. He's super fast, and he's always on the... Wherever anybody is, he's always there to tackle them. All right, nice first. We don't really need it, but I guess we'll take it. Yeah, but Byron Jones, he's always the one to tackle someone. He's super good. I recommend getting him if any of you guys want him. Oh my gosh, I just got lit up by Clowney. Yeah, so I'm not trying to get a turnover on this drive because there's only... Eight seconds left, and he could take an easy field goal. I'm pretty sure he gets ball after the first half. So. All right, come on. Nice. Oh, my gosh. That would have been it. That would have sealed the deal. Oh, my gosh. Of course. I He barely talked. I think I ran into him, too. I ran towards his direction. That's, oh my gosh. 
Dang it. I could have had a touchdown, and he definitely would have left after that deep kick. Yeah, that's smart play. Last time he didn't do that, and he got to his 20-yard line. All right, come on. All right, so we're going to do a zone play. This is a weird zone play. We have defensive linemen playing zone. I'm just going to blitz all of them. Nope, no Hunter Henry play. Exactly, throw it away. Would have been nice if we got a sack, but I'll still take the throw away. Instead of a Tory Holt cross, a tight end cross, or a Eric Dickerson stretch. Come on. Oh my gosh, he went back to it again. I keep, I'm, see, he has a tight end on the right and then Eric, er, Tory Holt on the left, so he crosses both of them. Run. Fumble. Nice. See, Kevin Green again. I don't know if he caused it, but he definitely recovered it. Yeah, slide next time, buddy. I, how has he not quit yet? All right, we're going to try that same play again. It worked last time, and we should have scored on that play. Oh, he's, he's guarding it with Keekly. Yeah, I... Yeah. No one's going to be open on that one now. He's locked it down. Yeah, so that play, whenever I play, like, um, mutt squads or head-to-head, -head, that play always works for me. Oh? 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 Oh, my gosh. Saquon Barkley, you just juked out the whole team. We only got two yards on that, but we just juked out the whole team. What was I saying again? Something about mutt squad. Oh, yeah, that play. I, the play action play where two guys go up and to the right and the guy on the right side goes up and to the left. That play always works the first time, but if someone uses the middle linebacker with like Keekly or Willis or Shazier, I'm always getting guarded on that play the second time. All right, we're just gonna run it, you know, chew clock. I'm not really in the mood to play this game still because, you know, Super annoying. Nice. Oh, he dropped that. All right, it's third down. I should have ran it that time. Or I should have kept the run play on. All right, we'll just do some slants because normal four vertic verticals doesn't really work. Nice. That's Michael Thomas. I'm getting so lucky with these catches, but at the same time, I mean, I'll take it. Anything to make this guy quit so I can just win already. Nice blocks, all right. Spin. Oh, I almost scored. I don't know who that was in the back. I don't know if it was Minka Fitzpatrick or something, but that time we actually got past Pat Tillman and not fumbled like we do every game with Saquon. We're just going to do a zig on Sammy Watkins because I don't really see anything getting open on this play. All right. Oh, that was so risky. No one was really open on that play. So I went with the risky play. Dang it. All right. We didn't gain any yards on that play. I have it on two clock, though, so maybe he'll realize that he really can't win this game. I'm going to be looking for George Kittle on this play. Yep. All right. And look, I'm just going to fall over. I'm not trying to get hit sticked as hard as I can. All right, so... The quarter's over, so I'm not going to waste an extra play because there's no time that's going to get drained. All right, so that's the end of quarter three. Don't know how this guy hasn't quit yet because doesn't really have much hope. I'm, I'm at the five-yard line, winning by 10. It's going to be 17 pretty soon, or th 13, doesn't know, or I don't know yet. Full-on blitz. Mm, 
oh my gosh, that was so risky. Yeah, so from what I could see, no one was really open on that play. Just threw it away. I'm going to stick to the crossing routes. But I need some blocking too because this guy is looking to blitz all of his players. All right, I'm going to look for Sammy Watkins or Calvin. Yeah, they oh my gosh. Of course, Madden just made my momentum push me out of bounds. Blocking everyone. Mark Andrews, you're on an out route. Touchdown, Mark Andrews. All right, he has to quit here. There's no way he doesn't. Yep. All right, he he's quitting. All right, so that was a nice win against a really sweaty team. Um, like, subscribe, share with your friends, and I'm out. Peace.